Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the conclusion of my 10th anniversary run of Mass Effect 2. Renegade run, okay? So before we even begin, what I'd like to say is thanks to everyone who's been tuning into this playthrough. Thank you to everyone who's been supportive during the playthrough. You know, it's been going on during a time when I've been playing other new releases and stuff for a big chunk of it. And I'm appreciative of those who've tuned in, whether on YouTube or Twitch, and who contributed during the streams. And also, those who have not complained that I'm playing something old uh, just because there's other new releases out. Alright, I appreciate that you guys understand that the variety of content is what I'm out for, or out to do, and that I really enjoy doing a variety of stuff. Alright, for this conclusion, we're going to change the appearance one last time, I think. We're not going to do any of those weird ones. We're basically going to do this, and we're going to change it up. Let's do that. Let's do shield harness vest. Or do we want to do Aegis vest? Let's do Aegis vest. Shoulder guard, amplifier plates, strength boost pads, and asymmetric defense. Now let's do strength boost. Gauntlets, stabilization gauntlets, heavy damping, offhand ammo pack. Let's do heavy damping. Greaves, stimulator conduits. Life support webbing. I just like this whole armor set right now. Let's go with that one. Material, we can change the material. Let's go with that. Tint. For the finale, let's go with all black. change the pattern. Look at that. Now, I think I, I think I still like this pattern. I just want to make it, yeah, I want to make it like, like dark red or red. How about that? Alright, let's go with that. That's pretty cool for the finale, I think, right there, right? The last time I'm ever going to be able to do this, so I might as well change it up a little bit. Okay, uh, German Andy Cap did a 200 bit cheer and asked, is Jasper going crazy in the mornings? If so, is it likely he's frustrated over not going out to play with female kitties? No, he has no idea about that and he's an indoor cat and he doesn't see female kitties, so he would not be affected by that. However, last night, as I'm sleeping, he wakes me up to vomit up hairballs all over the bedroom floor. So I cleaned them up as best I could in the middle of the night and then this morning I'd use carpet cleaner and hopefully the stains are gone. It was not, not pleasant. Beast Bot, resubscribe for two months in a row, so make sure you use Garrus as a squad leader. Legion is the tech specialist, Samira is the biotic expert, and Morden as an escort. All right, thank you, because I forgot what the actual, uh, what the actual requirements are to pass this final suicide mission, so thank you for that. My God, his face is screwed up. All right, so let's say goodbye to our space hamster. It's so cute, we gotta do it one more time. Space hamster comes out. Super cute, slow. Runs away. Okay. So, the only achievement we didn't do, rescue Dr. Amanda Kenson without attracting hostile attention. We screwed that up. And complete the Shadow Broker on Hardcore. We didn't screw it up, we just weren't playing on Hardcore or Insanity. But everything else we've done, we did every other achievement. Oh, never mind. Incinerate the armor of 25 enemies. Oops. I wish I had known that. I would have. I would have done that ability way more often. Complete the game on insanity again. We didn't play it on insanity, so I wasn't going to get that one. <clears throat> so it looks like we were like four short. Yeah. Four achievements short of maxing everything. Examine the relic. It makes noise. Anything new on the private oops, on the private terminal? No new messages. Steve the fat guy just subscribed to the channel. Thank you, Steve the fat guy. Thanos the power says today I'm getting Animal Crossing. Congrats, you will probably enjoy it. Although there are some times when there's like limitations on what you could do in one day. I do think the game's outstanding. 
You know, I might, sh I might do it. Maybe I should talk to all my crew before we finish, right? Maybe they all have something final to say. The IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take a shuttle to access your next location. Can't... Oh, I could do shotgun extra rounds. Shotgun extra rounds upgrade. <clears throat> ah, enhanced get shields. And oh. Well, this would have given Legion a widow anti-material rifle. Somehow I don't have enough platinum. Are you kidding me? Do I really have to go gather platinum to get the final upgrade? Still hard to believe Malin betrayed me. Betrayed my work. Disgusted by his actions. Proud of his nerve, though. Always thought he lacked backbone. Shame I had to kill him. Might have made a good <laughs> member of the team. Willing to get his hands dirty. What about Malin's data on the genophage? His attempts at a cure? Gone now. Could recreate, but could always have recreated. Or improved. Taught Malin everything he knows. Didn't teach him everything I knew. Not important now, regardless. Appreciate you helping me back on Tujanka. Should get back to work. Wasted enough time already. Lots to do. Talk later. We have these little dialogue trees to do with everyone now. We already talked to... Oh, God. We already talked to Jacob. <clears throat> I'm trying to think for everyone who I did their loyalty missions that they have more dialogue now. <clears throat> the IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy system. Yes, I know. You told me. Beast bought to me $7. Says, will you play Final Fantasy VII Remake on classic difficulty? Classics where you only focus on commands, like the original game, while the other difficulties play like the newer Final Fantasy games. See, here's the thing. I actually expressed interest in playing it on classic because I actually really like the turn-based combat of Final Fantasy VII. I feel it's some of the best in the entire series. And then people gave me shit for it when I said that. I you they were like, to access your oh. Location. So you're not going to play the modern game. You're just going to play the old school game. That's not going to be fun. And I was like, well, that kind of sucks. You know, why can't I just play it how I want? <laughs> so I don't know. Like, I think I would actually really enjoy playing it turn-based, but I don't think people want to see that. They want to see the modern gameplay mechanics. So more than likely, I guess I'm just going to do whatever the default is, I guess. But thank you, Beastbot. You're the top tipper of the day. I appreciate that, man. <clears throat> Let's see. Morinth haunted my dreams and waking hours equally. For the first time in 400 years, I am free. I am a ruined vessel of sorrow and regret, but I am free. It is not a feeling I can describe. Hmm. What will you do now that Morinth is gone? Assuming I survive your mission, I am a Justicar. Injustice still exists, and perhaps even other Ardatyakshi. You don't want to settle down? I did. I returned to my homeworld and tried to start a family. I will fight and struggle all my life. That is my fate. When I die, it will not be in bed. I am at peace with that. Huh? <laughs> you still control the direction of your life. I have chosen this path. I truly am at peace. Due in no small part to you. Die a paragon! Well, there's no way to get any renegade there. So, <clears throat> did the crew say anything at the end of the game here? Nope, we already exhausted all their dialogue much earlier in the game, so they got nothing to say now. <clears throat> I was just thinking about you. That's it? Liara Tassoni's got quite a reputation. I've done business with her people before. Yeah, I guess because we already did that, that. That was the first loyalty quest we did in the whole game, right? So I guess there's really nothing, uh, nothing further here. <coughs> Dane's in here. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk. Certainly. You know, when I went looking for an assassin, I expected to get a badass. You seem more like a monk. In my experience, those who are truly dangerous don't act like they are. I mean, that's I true. I've trained my body for this role since I was six years old. 
if you're tr if you're truly if you're truly something, you don't have to act like you are. You just are. You know what I mean? Like you if you're a badass, you don't have to walk around. Oh, I'm a badass and dress a certain way. You don't have to do that. You just you know you're just a naturally that badass person. It's people who are fakers or posers who have to have that crazy air outward appearance about them because they have to try to portray something that maybe they're not. You know what I mean? Why did your parents agree to this? The agreement was made under the compact. It was an honor for our family. The compact? We live on the Hanar homeworld because they rescued us, some of us, from extinction. We owe them our lives. That is the compact. But you don't kill for the Hanar anymore. You're freelance. What changed? I was asleep for a long time, yes. I paid no attention to what my body was asked to do, but then... Laser dot trembles on the sky. Oh. One finger twitch, he dies. Then, the smell of spice on the spring wind. Sunset colored eye is defiant in the scope. The laser dances away. <laughs> my apologies. Drell slip into memory so easily. Yeah. It's pretty crazy how they do slip into uh, memories, isn't it? How he like recounts it frame for frame exactly what happened, including his, even his other senses. It's not a problem. We'll talk again later. Of course. Okay. Oh, I got Renegade. I am Razor. Yes, I'm aware that the base game of Final Fantasy VII is 30 to 40 hours long, but I guess what people were saying is there's going to be a significant amount of side content in it. <clears throat> like, we're talking like distractions, like darts games and stuff like that, mini games. If you do all of it, apparently there's a lot more content to the game. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's that's what I the vibe I was getting. How may I help you, Commander? I'll see you later, Doctor. Commander. No, no, uh. That's so creepy the way she spins around in that fucking chair, like a robot. Alright, let's see if Legion has something to say. Something to say. Shepard. Nah. The fate of the heretics? What happens to the heretics now? Many heretics remain in isolated systems. It is not impossible for them to rebuild. There's still a chance they could attack again? Ugh. The probability is low. If so, it would take many years. I have All to right. get back to work. Acknowledged. Fuck that. Take many years. You mean like, from Aspect 3? Haha. <laughs> and that's what they were getting at. How can I help you, Commander? Do you have everything you need? Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, thanks again. I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. So who cares if there's anything to say, right? Just trying to see if there's any final dialogue options before we finish the game. Shepard, <clears throat> need me for something? You got a minute? Sure, just killing time anyway. I wanted to thank you again for your help ah. with Sedona's. Whatever happens with the Collectors, or the Reapers, or whoever else comes after us, I know you'll get the job done. Whoever else? You actually think we'll find something worse than Collectors or Reapers? I like to expect the worst. There's a small chance I'll be pleasantly surprised. Thank you to Bertram from Jesse who did a 100-bit cheer. What you said is incredibly fucking stupid, and I'm not going to read it. Thank you for the cheer. One way or another, we'll get the job done. I tell you I'm skeptical, but Saren doubted you and didn't go well for him. Uh -huh. It's strange going into a suicide mission on a human ship. Your people don't prepare for high-risk operations the way Turians do. Oh, yeah? I thought you'd be used to high-risk operations on human ships. I mean, think about tracking Saren to Ilos. Sure, but that was quick. We raced out, landed, blew up some geth, and saved the galaxy. This time we've got Miranda and Cerberus and that AI all telling us what we're up against. I think I preferred blind optimism. Uh, Thanks for the talk, Garrus. I'll see you later. Sure thing. That was a cool discussion. I like I like I really do like his character. <clears throat> I think I already talked to her like after her mission. Miranda, yeah. What can I do for you? I'm pretty sure. You have a minute, Miranda? Of course. I've been meaning to speak with you, in fact. Maybe not. <laughs> That's another dialogue option. I wanted to apologize. Oh. I didn't fully believe you'd be up to the top. Oh, it's the end game. And it seems I was wrong. Yeah, because we're at the end game now. Frankly, 
Based on what I've seen, I wish Cerberus had recruited you earlier. With your intelligence, you could have landed any job you wanted. Why choose this? <clears throat> because I still envy the time Morden spent with the Special Tasks Group, working with people as smart as he was. Cerberus never tells me that something is impossible. They give me my resources and say do it. And they've given you even more. A new life, a new ship, the elusive man's personal attention. What? You disapprove? No. I'm just impressed. You're... Well, look at you. A kid from the slums of Earth. No family. Little no. formal education. The stupid backstory you just choose in a menu. Ha <laughs> And you've done more than I could. Despite everything my father did to make me perfect, you're... you're the best humanity has to offer. This again? <laughs> Does it always have to come back to your father's genetic tailoring? This is what I am, Shepard. I can't hide it. The intelligence, the looks, even the biotics. He paid for all of that. Every one of your accomplishments is due to your skill. The only things I can take credit for are my mistakes. You're jealous. Wait a minute. Are you jealous? <laughs> Don't be absurd. The genetic mutt that the elusive man put in charge. That must stink. First, it's not a competition. Second, based on your combat records, you're practically a perfect <clears throat> bloody human specimen. What? What? Oh, uh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know the mission comes first, and I'm glad we can work together. What is that stupid option? Out of nowhere? It's most definitely not a I guess that was the, that was the renegade I'm option. To serve with you. I, should get I got plus six work, renegade for, for it. Good. I'm like, oh, what? No. <laughs> All right. We almost maxed the renegade. Yeah. Well, I don't think we're. I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible to max renegade. How do you do it? I'm so I'm only halfway into the final one, and there's been critical dialogue choices I've missed because I haven't maxed it. Yeah, I've done. I've, I swear I've done all the big renegade choices. So I don't know how this is possible. All right, let's keep going. There's more people to talk to. Maybe there's more renegade dialogue options. Oh yeah, there's still four more people down here. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I did all the DLC as well, Stinky Dicks. We're done. We've done every DLC. I've done all the major renegade choices. Killing, slaughtering people at the, you know, to, for the for the greater good and everything. Like, and it's still, it's not maxed. It's pretty tough. <clears throat> pretty tough to figure this out. Who's here? Oh, okay. I didn't talk to Grunt after his mission. Or not Grunt. <clears throat> I like it. I have a clan. That makes me... It makes me want to fight, not just able to. At Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him. To tear out his spine like a trophy. Can you focus that on our real enemy? Or do I have to lock you up for the ship's safety? I get it now. It's part of what I am. I was just delayed because of being tank bred. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan, I like it. Our huh. enemies are in trouble, Shepard, and we better not run out of targets. It's interesting. So, if you remember, his, he, the reason we did his loyalty mission is because he thought, "Oh, I got this uncontrollable rage in me. I'm afraid I'm going to like unloose uh, on your ship. We have to go figure out what's going on." <clears throat> then, after going to Tachaka, his home world, he basically just realized it's part of his culture. It's part of who he is is to have that innate rage, but to focus it towards the end goal is how th the Krogans uh, handle it. And it basically, he didn't have it at first. Like you said, I'm tank bred, so it didn't kick in right away. That's interesting. I need you to stay in line, Brent. If you can't stay focused, you're a danger. I'd never stab you in the back, Shepard. Warriors like you and me, straight to the face. Kidding. Kidding. Wow. Another two renegade from that. Okay. Still getting tiny bits of renegade here and there. So I believe... Tali and Jack would be in here. Tali's Kenny, over here. What has the oh. new shielding done to your power grid balance? Not much. With built-in capacitor subsystems, they have a surprisingly low draw. Doesn't that mean the shielding boost wouldn't last long under fire? True. They're built for hard, fast strikes, not firefights of attrition. 
Anything new here? What can we do for you, Commander? I don't think so. We already had this Carry conversation, on. so... Will do, Commander. <clears throat> okay. Here's Tali. We haven't talked to her since her loyalty Kira, mission. I'm sorry I dragged you into Quarian politics. All that infighting. Seeing what my father did. You were the only one there for me, Shepard. The only cover I had against that storm. Thank you. Hmm. You... Uh... I imagine they're trying to fill your father's spot on the Admiralty Board. What will that do to the balance of power? I have no idea. Being exiled might have made it easier. A few people are suggesting me as a candidate. Replacing an admiral takes time, though. You may not have noticed, but Quarians like to debate. <laughs> no shit. Are Quarian politics always like that? No. Sometimes it can actually get unpleasant. We're a very social people, Shepard. We have to be, to make up for being stuck in these suits. And part of that means getting involved in each other's business. Hmm. The whole trial was insulting. You should have had time to mourn your father. I don't think life is about what you deserve. But my father would be honored that I chose to mourn him by blowing up a lot of gap. I should get back to work. But right. thanks for checking on me. Alright. And Jack's down here. I don't remember if we even talked to Jack's as the loyalty mission. These are the final dialogue things I never did. I needed to wipe that place off the map. Nope, I didn't. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. You don't know what it's like, Shepard, to have garbage like that following you. It marks you in ways you... You don't expect. You know yourself. You're not the only <laughs> one with the past, Jack. So dick. Everyone has so to deal. Dick, man. You know what? I like that. I piss and moan, and you say, grow the fuck up. That victim garbage, it's half me. I think I get that. You're killing Aresh Help. There was only one other survivor from that place, and you killed him. It's the same thing as blowing the place up. Now I'm the only one who remembers what happened there. I want it gone. I want it all gone. It's only in my head, and when I die, it dies. Hmm. I don't want this affecting our mission. Can't kill all that bad shit so easy, I guess. Have to live with it. Fucked up or not, the rest of the galaxy can deal. You deal with it. I don't care how you do it. This doesn't sidetrack us again. Understood? Yes, sir. Commander, sir. Whatever. <laughs> Seriously, though, you did something for me, and... Ah, shit. Huh. I'm not used to saying thanks. Plus six renegade for being a dick. Oh, it's tiny. I just did that. It was over... It was like 15 renegade or something for those dialogues. It barely raised it. I guess we're just not going to max it. Unless there's crazy renegade choices at the end here. I don't see how we're going to max Renegade by the end of the playthrough. I really wanted to. In Mass Effect 1, it's actually not that hard to do. I guess in this one, it's just way more difficult. I already went in here, right? Yeah. And then uh, Zaid should be on the other side. <coughs> don't forget to feed the fish one last time. Those fish are long dead. <laughs> Thinking about past missions. Got a minute? You might learn something. Here we go again. Collectors and Protheans. It's all about my pay grade. I'm more used to putting down rebellions, tracking down bastards who didn't pay their gambling debts. Still, even I know a galaxy-shaking revelation when I hear one. Makes fighting land wars for pay seem small time. Fish showed. What a name. Ask, what's my favorite music? Surprisingly enough, playing Doom Eternal recently reminded me how much I actually used to like, uh, like the, the soundtracks of games like Old School Doom, Quake 2, stuff like that. I used to rock that shit in my car all the time when I was younger. Okay. Uh, German Andy Cap did a 100 bit series. He's back in your Street Fighter days. Any fights did they ever break out? Were you forced to pull anyone off during fisticuffs? Um, I basically saw a few times saw almost come to blows. I never actually saw an outright fight break out. 
whenever outright fights did break out, because they did, um, basically a lot of stuff would happen. Like, they would be publicized everywhere, and people would end up getting banned and stuff. Because there was no tolerance for that shit. Street Fighter is a virtual fucking fighting game. It's not real fighting. It's not like that. And if people took it to that next level, basically tournament organizers wouldn't have that shit. You know what I mean? Um, so in general, even if people absolutely hated each other, they would try to keep that stuff uh, in line because they realize that... Uh, the IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact. Edie will not shut the fuck systems. up right now. I suggest you take a shuttle to access your next location. Oh, here we go. Like the Reaper IFF is finally hooked up and ready to go. That is not entirely accurate, Mr. Moreau. The device is powered, but it is causing some unusual instability in other systems. I recommend a more thorough analysis before we attempt to use it. What's the time estimate? Don't take any chances. Better safe than sorry with this tech. We'll take the shuttle for this trip. I'll make sure we're up and running when you get back. Commander, Miranda, I've already notified the team. We'll meet you on the shuttle. Once we're closer to our destination, you can decide who to take with you. Okay. I'm on my way. Joker, the ship is yours. Don't scratch the paint. Aye, aye, Commander. Hello, Moonwalkman. How's it going, man? So far, so good with the conclusion. I tried to unlock as much Renegade as I could before I went to the final missions, and now we're heading into the final mission, so... The last hurrah. Engineers, I'm telling you, right? Edie, your readings are off. It's radiation. You're just white noise. I have detected a signal embedded in the static. We are transmitting the Normandy's location. Transmitting? Huh. To who? Oh, hi. Shit. It was a trap. Propulsion systems are disabled. I'm detecting a virus in the ship's computers. From the IFF? Damn it, why didn't you scrub it? Primary defense systems uh. are offline. We can save the Normandy, Mr. Moreau, but you must help me. Oh boy, I don't if remember this at all. What? You're crazy! You start singing Daisy Bell and I'm done. Unlock my sealed databases and I can initiate countermeasures. The maintenance shaft in the science lab will allow passage to the AI core. Main corridors are no longer safe. The collectors have boarded. The emergency floor lighting will guide you, Mr. Moreau. God damn it. Yeah. Remember, he's slow. Why'd I get a plus two renegade? I don't know. Remember, he's slow. He has brittle bone disease. He's gotta move as fast as he can without hurting himself. Here come the collectors. God, what is that? Holy fuck. Oh my god! Wait, where am I going? Uh, oh, here we go. I totally forgot about this, uh... This part of the game, this mission, completely. Oh yeah, look at this, it's showing you where you are on the ship and where you get ahead. Detected on the crew deck. Joker, this deck is crawling with those things. Stay close, I'll protect you. Whoa, yeah, you'll protect me, all right. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, you could run? I didn't even know that. Main fusion plant offline, activating emergency H fuel cells. What the shit? Huh. Where the hell's Legion? I'm sorry, he went with us, right? Connect the core to the Normandy's primary control module. Great. This is where it starts. We were just all organic batteries. Guess who they'll blame? Well, this is all Joker's fault. What a tool he was. I spent <laughs> all day computing Pi because he plugged in the Overlord. <laughs> oh, 
I have access to the defensive systems. Thank you, Mr. Moreau. Now you must reactivate the primary drive in engineering. What? Oh, you want me to go crawling through the ducts again? I enjoy the sight of humans on their knees. That is a joke. No! Ah! The shaft behind you connects to the engineering deck. Good wow. Luck. Enjoy the sight of seeing humans on their knees. That's a joke. Gee, what a great time for a joke, Edie. Uh. <laughs> All employees proceed to the bottom Stop platform. All employees. They are heading towards the cargo bay. What happens if we go the wrong way? You get killed. Oh, that's creepy. Oh shit. Just ignore them. They'll never notice you. Engineering is clear of hostiles. Activate the drive and I will open the airlocks as we accelerate. All hostiles will be killed. What? What about the crew? They are gone, Jeff. The collectors took them. Wow. Oh, shit. I am sealing the engine room. I have control. on board, securing airlocks and cargo bay doors. <sighs> she, she killed them all. She killed all the collectors. But the whole crew got kidnapped by the collectors. That's fucked up. Send a message to <clears throat> Shepard Shuttle. Tell him what happened. Message away. Are you feeling well, Jeff? Thanks for asking. Damn. I wonder if he's living like that. If it means that, like, because of his brittle bone disease, he has, like, compound fractures in his body he just has to live with because maybe they won't heal and shit. That'd be really fucked up. Imagine being in constant pain because your bones are cracked and they won't ever heal. And you have to limp around for the rest of your life in pain because you're basically fucked. Damn, man, that's terrible. Oh. Everyone? You lost everyone and damn near lost the ship too? I know, all right? I was here. It's not his fault, Miranda. None of us caught it. Mr. Taylor is correct. The harmful data in the collector drive was even more sophisticated than the black box reaper viruses I was given. Huh. Are you okay, Joker? Is the virus contained? I'm not interested in excuses. I, I want to ask him this first, but I do want to say that too. Let me ask I this. heard it was a rough ride. How are you holding up? There's a lot of empty chairs in here. We did everything we could, Jeff. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> right, he's like Mr. Glass. He can move around, but one wrong step. He's fucked. We'll determine fault later. Is the ship operational? The IFF is cleaning online. With Edie hooked in, we can go through the Omega-4 relay anytime we want. Don't even get me started about unshackling a damned AI. <laughs> well, what can I do against collectors? Break my arm at them? Edie cleared the ship. She's all right. I assure you, I am still bound by protocols in my programming. Even if I were not, you are my crewmates. Your equipment, not crew. That's right. What's your assurance worth? Your loyalty rests on the flip of a quantum bit. Loyalty is rooted in mutual respect, common experience, and common cause. We share two of those. Save it for philosophy night. I will uh -huh. rescue the crew. We've done everything we can. It's time to take the fight to the collectors. All right, there's nothing else to do. We've done every loyalty mission. We've done every side mission we've come across. I guess we're just going to do it. The only thing I didn't do, I didn't get the minerals to our, the, what was it, platinum to upgrade Legion sniper rifle, but I don't think it's going to be a major factor in the conclusion here, so. Joker, <clears> head back <throat> up to the bridge. The rest of you, to your stations. Aye, aye, Commander. Just punch up the galaxy map whenever you're ready. Okay. I wonder if they'll allow me to get the, the platinum, right? I hope so. I hope they'll actually allow me to get I would like to get the, uh... I would like to get the, the, the final, final rifle for Legion, although, if I remember correctly, you sent him off to do something. I don't even think he fights at the end. 
<clears throat> I don't really remember. Does Jacob say anything here? Commander. Nah. Can I help you with Not really, I don't think. I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Sounds good. I could use some downtime. There's always something, right? The way some people talk, we may as well be dead already. Hard for the crew to relax on this kind of job. Hmm. Huh. You all right, Jacob? It's gotta be rough finding out about your father on top of everything else. I covered this. Oh, I didn't talk to him the yet. stuff we're dealing with? Way more important than any of my personal shit. Let it go, Shepard. I have. I've been around long enough to know you're bottling things up. I can't have any crew member distracted like that. There's only two ways this will go. It's a real problem, and you can't fix it with Psych 101. Or, it's nothing. And you're just dragging it up for no reason. Neither helps. Uh -huh. Just let it go, and we'll drown all this small shit in some bar after we save the damn galaxy. I have to get back to work, Commander. Damn. That was very matter-of-fact and very, uh... What's the word? Terse? Short manner? He's like, fuck that. I don't care about my feelings. <clears throat> Damn, everyone's gone. Look, all the crew is missing. So everyone who used to be here got kidnapped. That's fucked up. Encrypted transmission from the elusive man. I see word of the attack feels like a direct insult from the collectors and a sign that we got them scared. Loss of your crew is devastating, but remember that they're signed off for the mission knowing the risks. Miranda has likely argued for delaying rescue efforts until you're fully prepared to go through the Omega-4 relay. I know you're eager to leave, but rushing off would be a disservice to your crew's sacrifice. When you're ready, you'll have my full support. Get it done, because no one else can. <clears throat> so the only thing we need to do is get some platinum. <clears throat> I guess we've searched all these planets fully, huh? Yeah, they're all 100%. Poor. God damn it. I need platinum and poor. The Ocean of Lover has resubscribed for uh, 11 months in a row, 18 months total. This is 18 prom months and counting. Loving your old and new playthroughs every day. Keep up the fantastic playthroughs. Are you going to play Modern Warfare 2 Remaster? I know I am. Uh, as I said earlier on the stream, it depends on time constraints. <clears throat> More than likely, if I were to play it, it would not be immediately. It would probably be like later on this month. At a time when there's not a lot going on, because I, I'm you're basically maybe only doing one or two new releases. Um, keep in mind, I am doing Viewer's Choice this month too, which kind of makes it tough. But <clears throat> we'll see if time permits. I'm interested in it for sure. I actually remember playing that one as a late night release. I remember sitting there in the middle of the night after the game had come out, you know, at midnight and later playing it all night, and I beat the campaign in one sitting. It's just pretty crazy beating it like five, six in the morning and uploading the entire playthrough to DSP Gaming back then. Actually, at that point, for Modern Warfare 2, it was actually Dark Side Phil, I think. Now that I'm thinking about it, that was before before DSP Gaming existed, if I remember correctly. Yeah, there's not much. Probe launched. <clears throat> yeah, it's rich, but the things it's rich in are not the thing I need. Platinum. Damn it. Probe. Probe away. I need fifteen thousand. <clears throat> Aha, there we go. Probe away. Nice. We got it. Let's go buy the Get Sniper Rifle upgrade. Bionichu says, I just watched part of your Final Fantasy IX. Uh, let's play interested in 7 or 8. 7, I'm playing the remake. I'm not really interested right now, maybe in the future. Because after after we do the remake, that's only basically the first part of the story. Maybe people want to see the rest, so maybe I'll do it in the interim as we wait for the next one to come out. Um, 8, I do not like at all, but if people ever want to see it as a remaster playthrough, maybe I would consider it. <clears throat> Okay. Alright, I think we're ready to go, but the question is, where the hell is the final mission? I don't remember. 
<clears throat> I think we have to go to Omega because we're going through the Omega 4 relay, right? Yeah, see, there's really nothing else to do. I've done everything else in the game. Besides the Platinum Rich Planet, so... Okay. To Omega. Alright, I think it's time to do it, guys. Omega 4 Relay is surrounded by hazard beacons and automated warnings. Over the last thousand years, many ships attempted to pass through it, but none returned. The only ones to pass freely back and forth are the collectors. No one knows what's at the other end. <clears throat> okay. Please confirm destination, Shepard. The Reaper IFF is online, but there is a chance that the Normandy may not survive the Omega-4 relay. Once we are en route, we are committed. We need everything ready. We have to rescue our crew. I'm done waiting around. The collectors are about to find out what happens when you piss me off. <laughs> Plotting a course for the Omega-4 relay. ETA about two hours. I'll let you know when we arrive. All right. Well, we'll pull close for viewers' choice. Two weeks, so it started on Sunday. So probably not this Sunday coming up, but the Sunday after. So give it around two weeks. Oh, oh, man. Joker is finalizing preparations now. The trip should take a few hours. I'll admit it, Shepard. I'm impressed. You got us here. Are you ready? Absolutely. I hope so. No, not that it matters. We're going in blind, and we don't even know if we'll survive the trip. No way in hell we're ready. But we don't have a choice. The elusive men wanted someone who could deal with bad odds. You'll get it done. We'll get it done. I'll inform you of any changes. Otherwise, we'll be there in a few hours. Good luck, Shepard. See you on the other side. Okay. To the final destination. <clears throat> Who is the elusive man, really? Shepard, I wish I had more information for you. I don't like you heading through that relay blind, but we don't have much choice. You know me. I like the challenge. This is as good as it gets. That's why I brought you back. Always willing to take on the impossible. <laughs> Despite the danger, it's a great opportunity. The first human to take a ship through and survive. Join us? He wants us to come with us. I've got room on the Normandy if you're that eager to see it. <clears throat> it's a tempting offer, but it's not my place. I just wanted you to know I appreciate the risk you're taking. Regardless of your opinion of Cerberus, of me, you are a valuable asset to all of humanity. Be careful, Shepard. And then in Mass Effect 3, find out truth about the elusive man but I will not spoil in case we ever play it again which we might Captain Kami at Chase says are you going to do the we'll census or make them come to your home I did that immediately as soon as I got notice of it Let's I did it online it, it takes like 10 minutes not even so yeah there's a US Reaper census I going on right now where they ask questions about your family and stuff Commander Drive core just lit up like a Christmas tree alright here we go Drive core electrical charge at critical levels rerouting Go. Awesome music. Brace for deceleration. Da, 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 da. Oh, shit. Yeah, look, it's all the other ships that got destroyed in this relay. You gotta dodge them all. Uh. <sighs> Too close. must be all the ships that tried to make it through the Omega-4 relay. Some look ancient. I have detected an energy signature near the edge of the accretion disk. Jesus, look at that. Has to be the collector base. Take us in for a closer look. 
nice and easy. So because we got all the ship upgrades, we're able to survive. If we hadn't bought the proper ship upgrades, you actually get killed here during this segment. And that's the end of the game. And it's like, oh, maybe we should go back and buy those upgrades. <laughs> so good thing we got them all. We have company. Taking evasive maneuvers. Just pissing me off. Ah, uh, nice. Take these down. As long as Ouch. Plating holds. That's right. That was the new plating right there. Let's give it to him. That would have been the end of the Normandy if I didn't have the new plating. the team now i should take legion because yeah because we didn't even use your legion yet so we should take legion for sure um all right a couple shout outs uh death the thriller we subscribed for eight months a great playthrough with the good work thank you to thriller um philly buckeye cheered he says if we go on the census website can we fill it out the way it works is everyone in the united states is going to get in the mail something that has a unique census code on it and you use that code to access the site with that code, and then it's like, I think it's like 10, 15 minutes of questions. It's just general stuff. It's about you and who lives with you and stuff like that, just so they know how many people live where, basically. That's all it is. <clears throat> yeah, but you got to do it. If you don't, the census people will come to your house to make you do it. Of course, and now we're all in lockdown, so they probably wouldn't be coming until after all this changes with the, with the pandemic. But, uh, yeah, that's basically the way it works, is if you don't fill it out, then they th th threaten to come to your house and stuff. Um, Rolf Swayze, resubscribe for 18 months. Thank you, Rolf Swayze, for the resale. <clears throat> okay. Let's take Legion and... How about Legion and Grunt? Why not? Just for fun. So, Legion, we haven't used it all yet, so we can go right to get Shield Boost, right? Perfect. Now... Heavy gets shield boost as the shield's increased strength enables it to absorb impacts from even heavy weapons. Look at that. Or, rerouting the shield generator can boost your, your, your weapon damage. But it's only 10%. It's lame. Yeah, let's just do double shield. That's cool. We still need one more point for Grunt to max his fortification. So. Alright. So... This is the one we bought specifically for him, right? Yeah. The Viper Sniper is the one we've been using, but yeah, this one is a special one just for him, I believe. <clears throat> I guess we'll have him use the Collector Rifle against their, use their own shit against them, right? Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oculus. next to me and instantly vaporized me. Fuck. That sucked. That sucked. Instrument vaporization. Vaporization. I'm just 
stay here. Kinetic barriers are not designed to survive impact with debris that size, Jeff. <laughs> well, I guess it's a good thing we upgrade. Go in. Because some great music. I remember the music at the end of this game is outstandingly good. Bum, 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 bum. Come on, find some room. Kinetic barriers at 40%. Reroute non critical power. This is gonna hurt. Actually in a cutscene here. Damage report. Kinetic barrier steady at 30%. No significant damage. Nice. Take Take all the upgrades. Keep it slow. See if we can avoid any more attention. I have detected an you enemy say? Thing for the cargo hold. That thing again. This one's up to Shepard. Let's go again. See if you can find a place to land without drawing attention. Too late. Looks like they're sending out an old friend to greet us. Another one of the stupid ships. Alone Light Cheerio City. Phil, great gameplay. I've submitted fan art on the King A forums. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you. I'll have to check that later. Thanks for the cheer and thank you for the fan art. The epic music at the end of the game. Gun. The new weapons, this is the, the other way that you survive this part is only because you have the new weapons installed. Without this, you can't survive this part either. Take like that, that, motherfucker! Of bitches. Get in close and finish him off. Everybody hold on, gonna be a wild ride! This is Joker, all Joker, you know. His expertise. I think he didn't have a pilot who's Joker. Fuckers, they got the revenge. Mass Effect field generators are offline. Edie, give me something. Generators unresponsive. All hands for impact. Well, shit. Well, at least they landed in one piece, but uh, I don't know how they're getting out now. <laughs> Joker, <clears throat> you okay? I think I broke a rib. Or all of them. Multiple core systems overloaded during the crash. Restoring operation will take time. We all knew this was likely a one-way trip. I'll do whatever it takes to stop the collectors, but I plan to live to tell about it. I'm glad you're in charge. <laughs> What's next? Joker, you and Edie get the ship back online. Miranda, <clears throat> gather everyone else in the briefing room. We need a plan. All right. Very nice. 